afternoon, everybody. And such a gray day today. Up, Rosie. Are you gonna hang out with me while I get ready for church? Are you? Are you my little partner? And there's Cooper. Say, Mom, you can't talk to Rosie and not talk to me. <laughs> but Rosie's super happy because I changed her cage earlier this afternoon. Yes, I know. Kisses from Cooper. Precious. So weird in here without having my tree, but I still have my garland up. Hey, stop. Cooper. He's a little harsh with Rosie sometimes. It's okay. She's not harassing you. She's hanging out in her own cage. You're hanging out out here. Don't bother her. Oh, time to start getting ready for church because tonight choir and youth starts back up. And I'm so excited. It's been like a month and a half since we've last um, met up. It's so dark out this morning. It's almost kind of scary, especially because of how warm it is. But look how dark it is out. The street lamp's still on. It's so dark. Good morning, everybody. It's kind of a freaky morning today. Um, I got up a little bit ago, and it's super dark outside, which is really weird. And also, it's like 60 degrees, and it's never 60 degrees in the winter in the morning. But it's supposed to get colder as the day goes on and be like in the like like 19 degrees by tonight and so it's really weird how it's going to drop and it's also raining off and on and the lights keep flickering so it's kind of freaky still flashing this is actually kind of like scaring me because like I don't know I mean if the power goes out then I mean we'll be okay we have flashlights and candles and you know we can have a fire but I don't know it's still scary the lights just keep flashing and the TV will click on and off and it's just scary, but on the bright side, Pretty Little Liars starts back tomorrow, and I can hardly wait. Oh my gosh. Another main reason I didn't vlog much yesterday, I just laid around with Mom again and watched, like, all of Season 3, pretty much, because she's only seen, like, what's out of Season 4 and, like, half of Season 3, so she's, like, watching it all, like, all the seasons. Seeing how it's so dark outside, I cannot get ready in my room. My mom's bathroom is like super duper bright, so I actually think I'm going to grab all the makeup I'm going to need in my Too Faced bag. Look, there's my tablet. <laughs> and then I'm just going to go up to the front window and get ready. It's pretty bad up there too, but it's the best spot in the house right now. Um, I actually get ready up there a lot because it's always brighter than my room and it has a bunch of windows and it's just really bright. So, normally I run back and forth grabbing my makeup, but today I'm just going to grab it all at once. And we'll see how that goes. Alright, so I just finished up doing my complete makeup. I did it here at the um, front window and, oh my gosh, I'm so beyond, ah, I'm so beyond in love with my eye makeup today. I, um, actually followed a tutorial for this look. It's completely using the Naked 3 palette. It's so pretty. It's a little bit smoky, um, but it's using colors like Strange, Black Heart, uh, 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 Liar, Nooner, uh, 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 mugshot. Just like, it's using like the last half of the palette and then like the highlight color. But it's so pretty. Oh my goodness. It's like, it's taupey and a little bit pink, but it, I don't know. It's mainly like taupey mauve. It's so pretty. I love it. Oh my goodness. It's a little bit dramatic. I paired it with a nude lip and just like bronzer on my cheeks because it's a little overwhelming for some blush. But I copied the look from... Oh, I'm trying to pull it up on my tablet here, but it's not working well with one hand. I copied the look from, her name is Kathleen Lights here on YouTube, and I just discovered her last night when I was searching tutorials with the Naked 3, because I wanted to try something new besides looks I had been creating. I wanted to follow someone else's, and so I found Kathleen Lights' video, and I watched it. It's called Naked 3 Tutorial Soft and Sultry, and that's what this is. I completely copied every step she did except for using black heart in the outer corner because that would have been really dramatic for me. Like, um, this is already a little dramatic, but not too bad. But putting black heart in the outer corner would be, like, really dramatic, I think. So, I did copy every step, and, yeah, I just... Kathleen Lights here on YouTube. Check it out if you want to see my inspiration. <gasps> but I love it. I'm going to comment and tell her that I did it and that I love it and that it's so pretty. 
But now I have to go start school, so yay. So I totally just realized that I wasn't even in focus in that video bit, so um, yeah, here's my eye. I just rewatched that video bit and I was like, really? I was out of focus the whole time? But yes, Kathleen Lights here on YouTube. Check out this tutorial if you guys want to see how I recreated my eye makeup copying her tutorial. I love it so much. <gasps> I just, it's so pretty. Hey baby, what are you doing? He says, well, I've had a very busy morning and I had a rough night. And so I just been relaxing and taking a nap. He's Mr. Mischievous these days, y'all. To finish off our lunch, we are eating thin dill chips. Look at this huge jar. How big is this jar? It's a gallon. Yep. Gallon of pickles, thanks to Daddy. Yellow. All right, so Mom and I are fixing to head out. We are gonna um go run some errands. We have to go, I think, just to Walmart. But um, who knows? I think it's just to Walmart. But we gotta run to Walmart because I need everything under the sun. I need a tablet case, electronic wipes, a new eyelash curler face wash, um, a lighter foundation, uh, I'm gonna pick up some new stuff for Maybelline, and then there's a few more things I need, like, I'm out of a lot of stuff currently, so, we are going to go, um, to Walmart, I'm actually really excited, because I haven't been there in a long time, there's a lot of new stuff out that's there, and I'm really excited, so I'm getting myself ready, and this is what I'm wearing today, because I don't feel like dressing up, so I'm wearing my yoga pants from Airpostal, they're periwinkle here, and they say, live, love, dream or something on the back. I don't know. And then my shirt is from American Eagle. Um, I'm, I think I'm going to wear my Uggs. I think Uggs. So there's the Uggs over there. And then I'm actually fixing to trade over my bag. I used this bag yesterday because it looked better with my outfit for church. I'm going to go back to my Roxy bag today. And actually, I don't know how cold it is outside right now. It was really warm this morning. And, um, by tonight, it's going to be like 19 degrees, so it's going to be cooling down throughout the day, so I think I'm going to grab a jacket and possibly a scarf. Here on my mirror, I have my Pretty Little Liar countdown. I don't know if you guys can see it. It says PLL, one day, take away that S. I've been counting down for the past six days here on my mirror. Every day I grab my marker and I change it to how many days left of Pretty Little Liars. But in case you guys are asking about my hair, I doubt you are because it's just the simplest thing ever. This is the um hairdo that I do when my hair is getting oily. I just take my Batiste dry shampoo, spray it in certain spots, and then I take one or two bobby pins. Today I just used one. I take the front section of my hair, twist it, and pin it back. And it looks good if you have one side tucked, if you have both sides untucked, this side even tucked. It just it looks good no matter how you wear it. In my opinion, it's, it's so simple, but um, it makes my hair look less greasy when I need to wash it, so that's my her of the day. I forgot to talk about this the other day, but I'm so excited because Pretty Little Liars has a clothing line coming out tomorrow, the day their premiere comes on, at Aeropostal, and I'm so excited. Oh my gosh, because the girls are always dressed so cute, and so it's going to be interesting to see what the clothes look like when they launch tomorrow. You girls need to hop on over to coupons.com and go ahead and print out some of these Maybelline coupons. It's save two dollars on any mascara or foundation at Walmart stores, but I found out you can use them on concealers, pretty much anything from Maybelline, almost anything. It might be everything, but I'm not sure, but I've used it on like concealer and primer and stuff like that, so I printed out some more of these today, and then also you can only print out like two or three, so I just lay it on top of the printer and scan it and copy some more, but they're good till February, and they've already been out there since like December, so really good coupons. Okay, so for the past few days, I don't know if you guys have been able to notice or tell a difference, but I've been using something different in my eyebrows. Oh my gosh, I totally just lost it, but I just saw it. Um, I think I started using it on, it was like Friday or Saturday, but I've been doing my eyebrows here lately with my Revlon eyeliner. Um, their eyeliner irritates my eyes, and so one day I was like, you know what, I'm going to try it out in my eyebrows. And I used this in my eyebrows, and it worked so well. I've been using it every day since. It's what's in my eyebrows right now. It matches my eyebrows super duper well, and I've been using it every single day. It's the Revlon Color Stay Eyeliner in Brown, and who knew? I just tried an eyeliner in my brows, and it worked. Who says you can't wear gray, black, and brown together? I'm totally doing it today. I keep adding stuff to my outfit. I also just put on this nude and cream scarf from Maurice's. <gasps> I love it. I got it for Christmas. Okay, so quick little haul here from Walmart. They have all sorts of new makeup right now. 
And so I have some two dollar Maybelline coupons. So I'm grabbing the baby skin, which I've been dying to try out. It's a face primer. And then I'm also grabbing one of their new buff lipsticks. It's in their whole nude collection that just came out. I'm grabbing 920 Nude Lust. I'm grabbing face wash that I'm now out of. I bought this literally like 10 times. It's my favorite. And then I'm also picking up a new eyelash curler because mine is slowly stopping to work after like a year and a half to two years. I also wanted to get a blush brush, but shockingly they're all out of stock of the one I came here for, so that's kind of upsetting, but I can always come back and check again sometime soon. New Sally Hansen. Here are all the new buffs, baby skin, the new stick blushes, and regular blushes. So my mom is looking at pajamas. I'm just going to show you guys a few more things I found I needed to get here today. I actually found a tablet case for a really good price. I like this one a lot. It's not a zipper. It just opens up. But it has um, a strap to keep it closed in there. And then it also has like little straps to keep it inside the case. I really like this one. It's similar to my mom's except it's kind of like um, black snake skin. It's not exactly snake skin but it kind of looks similar to it. I really like it. And then got some screen protectors. And oh my gosh you guys. We found New Year's Eve. The lady told me they didn't sell this here anymore a few weeks ago, but that we might find it in the $5 tub, and we found it today. Just been watching Pretty Little Liars again tonight. Mom is almost caught up. She's seen, like, part of season three, and then what's out so far of season four, but that's all she's seen. And so she's trying to get officially caught up, so she's watched all of season two. She's watched half of season three, so she wants to get fully caught up and know, like, every episode like I do. And so, um, we watched some more tonight, still watching it right now, but I'm going to pause and shower because my hair needs to be washed, and I'm not going to feel like washing it in the morning, honestly, because it's going to be cold, and I don't want to have wet hair, be even more cold, and I'm just going to be too lazy to shower in the morning. So I'm going to go ahead and get over with tonight. And, yeah, it's just been a really chill night. It's been messing on my tablet, watching Pretty Little Liars. I'm so beyond excited because tomorrow's the new episode. I can hardly wait. Oh, my gosh. Like, is Ezra A? Who's the person that has a twin? Because it's not Allison. I'm so excited. Allison's alive. A bunch of stuff we're going to find out in season four. I'm so excited. And also, The Bachelor started back up tonight. And I missed it because I was watching Pretty Little Liars. And I might miss tomorrow's episode too, sadly. So I'm going to have to watch both the episodes online of The Bachelor.